Filed Out opens with Stephanie on one of the last days of his visit on Sir Topham Hatt's railway. Sir Topham Hatt then states that Stephanie needs a little more help around here and stating that a diesel will be on his way soon. Much to the dismay of everybody, especially once the diesel arrives and, as typical behavior for most of the diesels, is kind of a dick. I've seen worse. At least you're all clean. So this diesel goes on and says that Sir Topham had to scrap all of them and feature more engines like him. Literally stating that he wants the genocide of all steam engines. So, shock grip the century, the rest of the engines aren't very happy over the idea of this guy literally wanting them to die. Bro, that's just the same shot of Don and Douglas from earlier. Meanwhile, the Diesel, who doesn't have a name by the way, is just purring like a freaking cat until some bowler hat guy's bowler hat goes flying off. The Diesel starts running, but is making a weird clinking noise. Turns out, the bowler hat is inside of him. As a result, the Diesel is unable to carry his train, so Duck and Stephanie have to do it for him. The two end up having to pull their train together, which makes sense because the two are pretty small engines to begin with and it was meant for a big diesel engine, but they managed to do it pretty successfully. The episode ends with Duck and Stephanie being congratulated by the other engines and the diesel runs into the sunset. He was never seen again. No, actually, this was his only episode. The next episode opens with Stephanie really wanting to carry some trucks, which comes as a shock to the other engines because trucks are generally not cool on their railway. Nevertheless, him and Percy decide to swap trucks for the day. As Stephanie goes on his way, he ends up stopping in front of a cricket game. As his driver and fireman watch the cricket game while they wait, unknowst to them, the ball actually lands inside one of the trucks. The players try to tell Stephanie, but he ends up leaving. So the players head into their old car named Caroline and try to race Stephanie down. Bolty has been in the background this whole time and he is still a hen house. And so the race is on, with Caroline complaining how she's getting too old for this, and with Stephanie's driver eventually cutting on that they're being chased and decide to play into the whole race. Eventually, once they stop, they realize that the ball is in there after a quick little explanation and the players get their ball back. However, the race was a little too much for Caroline, and so Stephanie takes her to the cricket field where they finish the game. These episodes, I actually thought, were pretty charming. There hasn't really been like a bad episode this season thus far. I actually really enjoyed these episodes. It just seemed like these felt a little different like the diesel episode in particular definitely felt like it also played in the whole genocide thing but you know was still a decent episode especially when the diesel gets his comeuppance and we never really see him again anyways the second episode was you know a, a fun little race definitely gave me thomas and birdie vibes although it was a little weird with the cricket players especially since we don't usually follow human characters in this show especially aggressively british ones like these cricket players but regardless i had a good time with these episodes but guys i hate to break it to you but even though we've only looked at 18 segments we have one more video left for steam timber 2024 which i honestly cannot believe <laughs> 